Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Starfields. If you're new here, I'm an autism mom and me and my mom have been on the Start Solutions plan for over 70 days. I'm down over 14 pounds now and I feel great. We're documenting our first 100 days vegan, so make sure you subscribe and stay tuned. Hey guys, how y'all doing out there? Happy Monday. Hope and pray you guys are having a blessed and wonderful day. This is day 60 something, probably like 67 or 68 for me on the Start Solutions. And I am feeling great. Although it's that time of the month, <laughs> TMI, I still feel great. What I've noticed is during that time of the month on the Start Solutions that I'm not as bloated and not as munchy, munchy, hungry, hungry. So um, I think just because I'm overall satisfied with the meals that I'm eating. So I'm gonna start my afternoon off with a cup of tea. And if you guys have been following my channel for a while, you know I like to use two different tea bags just to switch it up. It kind of allows you the flexibility to change your flavors. One thing about me is I don't like feeling stuck in anything. So I always like options. So I have lots of tea because I love to be able to switch up the flavors and that way you don't get bored. So I have my tea while it's getting nice and dark on me. I'm going to get some fruit. We have some watermelon that mommy cut up yesterday. So I'm going to eat some fruit and I'm going to take my antibiotic for my my uh, tooth that I had to get pulled because the side of my face is still swollen. So Yesterday, 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 we made the best pot of soup I think I've ever made. And I hate to say that because I've made some really, really good soups, but this vegetable soup yesterday, when I tell you it was so hearty and it could be sold, actually it could be sold in a restaurant. So it is delicious, you guys. It is so good. Gabriel enjoyed it. I enjoyed it so much. Mommy enjoyed it. One of the big differences that we did this time is we cut up those six potatoes and put in there. And that just made it so delicious. And then I put it on top of a uh, thing, a whole wheat pasta. So that was a delicious filling, filling meal. And so I think I'm going to do that again today. Um, I might just put it on some more pasta or I might cook up some brown rice. So I've got about 24 days left until I do my 90 days on the Start Solutions. I wanna see as much weight loss that's possible and healthy. I'm gonna cut back on the white rice and I'm gonna just try to eat as many um, whole wheat items as possible like the brown rice and the whole wheat pasta. It's always a healthier option and hopefully that will allow me to be able to lose a few pounds because I would love to see the 20 pound mark Right now, I'm hovering at around 13 pounds down, and so it would be great to get down to 20 pounds um, on the start solutions. <laughs> anyway, let's get the day started, figure out what we're going to eat. If you guys have not seen that vegetable soup recipe, please, I'm going to put it up in the card so that you guys can go back and take a look at that vegetable soup recipe. It was so delicious. Those potatoes made the big difference, and... Mommy had cut up six stalks of celery. So I usually make it with all frozen vegetables, but just those that, that celery, those fresh potatoes, oh, hallelujah. It was so good. So, so good. Shh. Come say hi to everybody. Come on. Say good morning, world. I'm Gabriel, and I'm so loud. One of my subscribers, Amy, said, I'm all about getting those veggies in. I have found the biggest key is finding the veggies you truly enjoy. And I think that is so, so, so true. Um, okay, go sit down. Let mommy finish. That's so true, you guys, about getting those veggies in. You have to figure out what works best for you. And so for me, I love vegetable soups. I love soups that you could just throw a whole bunch of vegetables in and just get all those delicious nutrients in one bowl. And so um, figure out which way works best for you. I know some people, they'll take a big handful of spinach and put it into their smoothie. Some people like to steam their vegetables. Some people like to eat a lot of salads, green salad, you know. So figure out which way is the best way for you and then try to add in new ways to make sure that you're getting the nutrients that you need. I was watching that Dr. Furman 
videos last night. And um, since I've been doing so much research on the Start Solution, he actually popped up in my suggested videos. One of the things he was talking about was nutrient dense uh, vegetables too. So I think that that's really, really key. Like while we're following um, the protocol, we wanna make sure that we're focusing not just on calorie density, but also eating foods that are the best for our bodies, have the most nutrients that they're putting into our bodies as well. So that's why it's good to have a combination of raw veggies and cooked vegetables. So uh, make sure that you mix it up a little bit, add some fresh green salads with lots of kale and you know some good spring mix and just different vegetables that you can eat that are raw, then also have um, your soups and stuff like that. And that way you can always have a good balance. I think that's the key, it's just having a good balanced diet so that we can live a long, healthy life. So just some food for thought. This is a delicious bowl of soup. Aren't leftovers the best? Make sure you subscribe because we're documenting our first 100 days on the Starch Solutions. See you tomorrow.